The Five Organs Department of Human Services is facing a $15 million lawsuit after two young girls in foster care were reportedly sexually abused. Our investigative reporter Gabrielle Carroll is joining us now with some of the new information. Gabrielle? This lawsuit says two girls who were seven and five years old were repeatedly sexually abused by their 13-year-old foster brother. The complaint says DHS knew that the teen boy had previously sexually abused his younger sisters and received treatment related to that abuse. Still, the lawsuit says DHS approved his placement in a foster home with six other children five of whom were under the age of 10. The lawsuit says the seven-year-old girl was repeatedly raped and threatened, and the five-year-old was sexually abused and forced to watch the teen abuse her sister. The foster parent reportedly asked DHS to remove the teen from the home after a month, but DHS didn't take the boy away until another month had passed. DHS told us that they don't comment on pending litigation. The agency is facing a number of expensive lawsuits, including a $100 million lawsuit filed in April about the sexual abuse by a foster father. In 2015, DHS paid out a $15 million settlement in a case in which nine foster kids were abused by their state-appointed foster father. We'll have all the details online at coin.com. Back to you.